Hi YouTube, this is Louise Fletcher, Abstract Artist. I've got a bit of a bee in my bonnet, so I decided to make a quick video. And the bee in my bonnet is about watermarks on paintings posted on social media. I know people are worried about their paintings being stolen. I know there's the odd horror story. I know sometimes people steal an Instagram profile and claim it's theirs. Sometimes your painting gets put on Pinterest without a credit to you. And sometimes people in China can take your paintings and replicate them over there if you're well known enough or if your art is commercial enough to make that worthwhile. But none of those things is as bad as your art not being seen if you want people to see your work. Of course, if you don't, but then you're probably not watching videos on YouTube if you don't want to get your art out there. The benefits of social media and sharing your work are so huge and the downsides, while I'm not denying they're there, are so minimal. Even if someone was to take your work and make prints of it, they wouldn't be able to sell lots of it. It's hard to sell artwork, we know that. You have to put a lot of yourself into the marketing of it. So people are not gonna get rich on the back of your artwork. If anybody was gonna do that, it would be you because most people want contact with the artist. That's the first thing. And also, as an artist, you're constantly evolving. So even if somebody does appropriate something you made a year ago, you've already moved on and they can't keep up with your growth. So you need to think about you and sharing, because that's why we make our work, is to communicate with other people. And what a watermark does is it puts a big barrier between me and the artwork. I can't experience the artwork when the artist has put this mark across it. And not just because it changes how the art looks, but also because it says, hands off, this is mine, right? Copyright Louise Fletcher or whatever I put on there. Well, then it's my art, not my art for you. I think when we make our art, we're saying, look, I made this. Have a look what I want to show you. I want to share with you. Making art is a generous, open, loving thing to do. And then when we slap a, a, a police tape over, the, over across it, don't come too close, we break that connection. So I see it all the time on people's websites and on social media and it just every time makes me go, Ugh. please be generous with sharing your art. Let people download it and put it on their desktops or their phone as a screensaver. Even make that easy. Maybe make, I don't know how to do that by the way, but wouldn't it be great if you come to someone's website and there's a downloadable screensaver that you can have? Because that person might keep that screensaver for years and one day be able to afford a painting. Or let a person print off one of your paintings and put it in a frame and put it in their house. Maybe a friend of theirs will come in and say, oh, who did that painting? It's all publicity, it's all promo. Be generous, be open. It's an abundant world that we live in. Things come back to you if you're generous. This is my experience. And yes, there might be someone one day who tries to rip you off, but that's their, their sad, lonely, bereft, scarce little life. And it's not any worry of yours. Keep making your art, keep sharing it, and please don't put a watermark on it. That's it from me this week. See you soon. Bye.